Hey, what's up guys, welcome back. Um, so before we run, we run our analysis, I forgot to mention that we have to define section properties for every project that we do. Even if a spring doesn't technically have any section properties, we still have to define it so there's a smooth transition when the program runs the code. So if we're going back to our uh, geometry modeling tools, about halfway down, you'll see section properties tool. Select that and then right click on it and then you'll get the selection properties tool window that comes up. And let's create one, call it spring. And because technically springs don't really have any section properties, just throw in a zero for all of our input criteria. On the right hand side, the fourth button from the top, add. And now we've added this section to our library, our section library. And we wanna update just above the add, click update. And I'll close and then just highlight everything just to make sure that everything is selected. And then save your project. And then from here, you're able to run the analysis and you should get zero errors.